God, that scared me. Jesus Christ. Travel can be very difficult to impossible. Patchy blowing snow can significantly reduce visibility. The hazardous conditions will impact the Tuesday morning. I didn't even get to turn on the radios yet. There better be a double header with that. Happens so fast. Oh, dang it! Dang it! There's no double header. But still, though, oh my god! <laughs> Holy moly! That came out of nowhere. Thank God I, thank God I came into the room in time. Wow. Or is that just one upgrade? That's probably just one upgrade though. on that upgrade. It's not even 3 o'clock yet. They only did one. They only did one winter storm warning, but I'm for sure that 3 a.m. they might expand it. So who knows what will happen. Uh, let me just fix that real quick. Um, oh, don't you dare tell me. Cold with lows in the upper 20s. North winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of snow 60%. Are you kidding me? Snow, mainly in the morning. Patchy blowing snow in the afternoon. Snow may be heavy at times in the morning. Additional heavy snow accumulation. Highs in the mid 30s. Oh my god. Winds 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts up to 25 miles per hour. This thing sucks. Chance of snow 80%. I swear to god. In the for the Scoharie Valley and higher terrain. It activated for the RWT, though. Though. Why did I say dough? I swear, why does this thing not... Really? 
Really? That's all I had to do? Just wrap the cord around it? Oh my god. I swear, why does the 262... Not, oh, not 262. The 602. Why does the 602 suck at activating for actual alerts, but it doesn't suck at activating for RGBTs? That's what I've noticed about this thing. Wow. I mean, at least I was able to turn on the FR800 before Albany decided to go early this time. <sighs> Thank God I came in here. Oh my God, wow. That was crazy. Alert works activated on third header for some reason, but trust me, trust me, I'm not even, that's not even the most worried thing I'm worried about. Well, anyways, now that we got that out of the way, well, finally got another EAS capture. So that's 560 now, so yeah. Alrighty then. Well, uh, everybody went off. Not everybody. Uh, the 602, the 522 I had turned off, the HH50 I had turned off, the Soralink I still had turned off, but the batteries are dying anyway. So, yeah. Pretty much the radios that I didn't get to turn on yet, aside from the 602. So, yeah. Alrighty then. Well, guess, uh, guess that wraps that up.